Ekor is a major player in the international recycling market. It has over a hundred sites in Europe and Asia and trades worldwide. The collection, recycling and trading of end-of-life materials is the core activity of the group and also its growth area. Among these materials, ferrous and non-ferrous metals account for 80% of the annual tonnage processed. Ecor produces and sells four types of recycled materials – ferrous metals, non-ferrous metals, paper and cardboard, and plastic. Thanks to its state-of-the-art industrial plant and its continuous investment in the best available technologies, the quality and the recycling rate of Ecor's products are constantly improving. Light scrap is sorted. End-of-life vehicles and waste electronic and household materials are completely depolluted. Every incoming load is checked, then sorted, before being shredded in homogeneous batches. Production offcuts can be compacted or cut, depending on their properties. They are usually collected directly from the workshops of Ecor's industrial clients. Ecor, through its sales, technical and financial experts, contracts with many of its clients to provide a worldwide reference system. Heavy scrap, discarded industrial machines, demolition products and production offcuts from shipyards and farm machinery manufacturers are cut with shears or oxyacetylene torch. Non-ferrous metals are collected in the 10 countries where the group's subsidiaries are present but also on all the world's continents via trading operations. Non-ferrous metals are also produced through specially designed industrial processes operated by the group's subsidiaries. ECOR's development worldwide since its creation in 1993 underlines the validity of its global strategy and makes ECOR one of the premier groups on its market today. For example, with the perfecting of the shredding process, in tune with its motto, recycling even more and better, ECOR's engineers have been able to build a shredder residue sorting unit which is among the most efficient in Europe. For ECOR, Recycling also means transport. Guaranteeing its customers just-in-time delivery in the best economic and environmental conditions also involves using the best available technologies. Thus, over 40% of the materials dispatched are transported by sea or inland waterway. Among its river and maritime resources, ECOR has at its disposal throughout the year a fleet of four ships through a partnership with a ship owner. Maritime and fluvial logistics, ships, access to port facilities and the creation and development of riverside terminals are paramount in the group's growth. Through its subsidiaries, the group manages a fleet of lorries, skips and mobile equipment which are among the most modern and sophisticated on the market and implements a policy of strict control of the quality, delivery times and environmental impact of its activities. Integrating the logistical resources into the recycling and selling process is the result of ECOR's conception of its business. The group invests more than 5% of its annual turnover in research and development. Two areas are targeted. The constant improvement in material recycling rates and the reduction of environmental impact at all levels of its activity. In addition, a quarter of its annual investment is in the areas of safety and the environment. In order to respond even better to changes in its market and the demands of its customers, ECOR actively pursues a strategy of external growth. ECOR has recently welcomed into the group leading companies such as the International Resilux Group or Metallifer and MJR, leading regional French operators, in line with its policy of harmonizing its commercial, industrial, human resources and financial operations. This expansion also enables ECOR to further secure its sources of supply. ECOR's activities cannot be relocated. Used materials are collected and recycling is carried out locally. And the group's subsidiaries play an active role in the economies of the areas where they operate, creating jobs at all levels of qualification. ECOR's business model offers all its employees and future employees some of the most worthwhile career prospects in the whole of the recycling and environmental sector. Spurred on by its growth, ECOR offers future talents the opportunity to work in a key economic area.
with international prospects. At the heart of global sustainable development, the recycling of materials answers the need for ever more responsible growth. Through its activities and its declared aim of recycling even more and better, ECOR is contributing to meeting a key challenge of the 21st century, material reborn.